Jeremiah V, let's enhance the world. Said no more. Say what? I said no more. I'm going to try to do this video real quick. I haven't done videos as often as I would like to. And I just want to address some things as far as the vegan lifestyle and some of the misconceptions that people get and why I became vegan. Why I became vegan, first of all, is because I wanted to cleanse my body of flesh so I can be a little bit more clear on what I want in life in regards to spirituality. That's the first reason. Um, not very religious, but I, I do consider myself a spiritual being. So I wanted to cleanse my body of flesh, remove all dead flesh from my body. And that's why I initially started. I started to do a little bit more research, came across some things, found out that you can cure certain diseases based off the food you consume. And I figured it would be something that I need to consider. And I also started to look at it from other perspectives as I got deeper into it. So from a moral standpoint, it made sense as well because I don't think that it is necessary for us to contribute towards animal slaughtering if we don't need to. We have so many options, so many delicious food options that are just as good, if not better, than the food that we're already accustomed to eating. So it wasn't necessary for me to eat it, and it's still not necessary for me to eat it at this point because I know what my options are. People always say, I need my meat. I need my meat. No, you don't. No, you don't. You don't need your meat. You don't even like the meat. That's why you put fruits and vegetables on it all the damn time. Lemon pepper, red pepper, salt and pepper, garlic powder, onion powder, oregano, basil, thyme, tomato sauce. All of that is vegan. All that is vegan. Alright. I ain't never seen a black person put uh, fried chicken on the eye with no seasoning. Never in my life. Never in my life. Okay. People talking to me like I'm a military veteran when they find out that I'm vegan. Oh, you're vegan? Oh my God. Oh, oh. Wow. Wow. Thank you for your service. I'm okay. I'm doing okay. All jokes aside, you know, um, it's something that I just wanted to vent to you guys about, man. That's one of the reasons why, you know, um, there's a lot of misconceptions, a lot of misconceptions. Um, one of the things that I get all the time is, do you get enough protein? Listen, if I get this question one more time, I'm going to throw up. Listen, let me ask you this. On... A day-to-day -day basis, how many grams of protein does your body need in order for it to survive off protein? Exactly, you don't know. You don't know. You don't know how many grams is in a damn cheeseburger, but you're wearing about... Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Because y'all crazy. Y'all crazy. Nothing but plants every day. Every day, cows eat nothing but plants. Where they get their protein from? Every day, their meal plan consists of the same thing seven days a week. Every day, just plants, 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 water, 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 plants, plants, plants. Where they get it from? Huh? All jokes aside, I'm just playing. But for real though, that's like one of the main reasons. Why I decided to become vegan. I just wanted to make this quick video. Um, and just let y'all know what was going on. I haven't done any food items. Or any. Uh, yeah any restaurants in a while. Um, I should get back to it. We should review some food options. And, and expand people's minds. Shall we? Because there's a lot of misconceptions. People don't think. People think that when you're vegan. Or even vegetarian. You are more restricted you're not more restricted you're actually exposed to more stuff that's one of the misconceptions now I will say that depending on what area you're in um, it could be challenging to go to food uh, vegan uh, to get more vegan options but um, it's def you definitely can eat good I definitely can eat like somebody asked me she was like she found out I was vegan she was like since you're um, vegan does your 
food have like um like flavor in it? For one, I only been vegan for four years. If the food that I eat got no flavor, I ain't gonna lie, I probably wouldn't last that long. You know what I mean? Like, I'm not just going to be walking around eating ice cubes with basil thyme in it all day. Like, that just wouldn't work. You know what I mean? Oh, what you eating, Jay? Oh, this is just H2O casserole. No, that's not me. But anyways, I just wanted to get on here and just talk and just uh, just clarify some things. Hope you guys have a fantabulous day. Thank you. Brush your teeth. Comb your hair. Brush your beard, even though I need to... Do something with my bit. Listen, don't judge me, okay? Mind your business. Mind your business, man. Love you.